Hi, <laughs> my name is Anderson and this is my YouTube channel. Now, I just wanted to give a little intro to this next video because as you will probably tell if you watch my last video, this is and was part of that last video, but it was just getting too long, you know? So I chopped that in half and I separated this anyways. So this video is connected to my tips on being hydrated and making sure you're getting enough water. It is a water recipe if you didn't know how to make water, but it's really especially great if you're someone who loves like the taste of something or if you want to bring it as an alcoholic beverage, like if you're not someone who drinks but you're going to a social event. Um, you can bring this as your drink for the night and you feel like included like you're not the just sitting there drinking water you know even though drinking water highly recommend obviously so it's a great option if you want to replace it for alcoholic beverages if you want to make it into popsicles it is the summer now I filmed this video back in May okay May and you can tell because if you look at my nails they're different and I had to check all the way back to my Instagram these little pink babies right there yeah mmm ah so good but um, that's how I know when a video was filmed based off of what my nails were at the time that's it I hope you enjoy it I hope you find it entertaining thank you so much for watching and subscribing and liking my videos it really does mean a lot to me since this is kind of a brand new passion project of mine good vibes man good vibes so enjoy hope you're having a great day remember that you are loved and you are important in this world and I am also dog sitting right now it's my dad's dog bear bear he just now decided to lay down. He's been pacing all day, but I'm gonna bother him. He's just the cutest thing ever. Bear, come here. He's so massive. Come here. Come on over. Show the people. Show the people. Come here. Sit. Yeah, this is Bear, as you can tell. Oh, look at him. He's just so cute. He's just so cute. Love him, and I'm so excited to have him for the week. Enjoy. Mm. We're back in the kitchen. Um, hey, if you're enjoying this video so far, please give it a like because I have drank so much water today, I don't even want to tell you how many times I've had to pee. That's just the reality of it. That's the whole purpose of being hydrated is so that you're flushing your system. Um, but please give this video a like because um, that's the sacrifice I had to make was just to drink a fuck ton of water today and yeah now we're here so my final tip is to I know this one's kind of like obvious but add stuff to your water because if you're the type of person who struggles drinking water um, but you love like pop or juice chances are you just love that kind of taste because I know some people think water has no taste um, so I'm going to show you two of my favorite little recipes that I love for when I want something other than like water but not juice because that's got like all kinds of stuff in it. So recipe number uno is a cranberry kind of lemon orange vial which I love. So I boiled some water already but these are just little like tea bags. These are a cranberry one so I love them. If you've ever had the like lemonade refreshers from Starbucks, that's sort of like what the goal is to make. Um, but it's a much more like, there's no sugar in it. So if you want sugar, you can add it. I don't want to add any sugar to mine, but just be aware of like how much. So I've got some boiling water. I'm just gonna do a little because I want the, oh, last time I did this, this broke. You kind of got to be careful because if it's like the temperature's too much for the glass, it might, it might be like, whoa, what's happening? But I forgot about that because last time I did this, it broke. Oh, well. So let these steep. That's really hot. Usually I do this in like mugs. I should have thought of that. Oh, well. We're here now. We shall find out. Okay. This is going to steep. Then... We want some lemon. 
I always try to pick out the seeds when I go like this. This is how we make it sort of like that lemonade-y type vibe. And also lemon's just great, like it's good for cleansing your body. If you want something with taste, and lemon gives it that like zing. baby squeeze it we're gonna save these because my next video I'm gonna show you how to use the peels for something else stay tuned bitch I don't know why I swear unnecessarily I just think it's funny orange zing let's just let that go in peels are gonna go in here which you shall soon find out. Peels. You know what? Just for kicks, let's add cranberry. This will help to maybe also make it not so hot right now. Also, like a nice zing. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. Mm, 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 mm. We're going to... I like to use hot water, especially with the tea, but with all of them, because I feel like it gives the flavors, it like helps the flavors in food, maybe just for kicks. I'm gonna throw a little bit of orange in it because I know I put my hands all over this. Welcome to my life where I'm just like a grub. I just want it to look cute, you know? Don't let me cook for you. I'm better when I'm cooking for other people because I'm more considerate, but when it's myself, I'm just like, put my germs in there because it's me. So I wish though everything floats at the top. I wish it would like disperse. Okay, let this steep. Be gone. Next, this one is lime, mint, and cucumber. 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 <laughs> anyway, so lime, mint, and cucumber. So it's a little bit more like refreshing, a little bit more um, mild in the taste. Squeeze of the lime and the coconut. So much. Ooh, baby. Man. Ow. Ow, my fingers slipped and like pushed, and this one. I'm, ooh, if you've ever had fake nails before, you know the pain of when that happens. You know the pain. Now I'm like scared to do it. Okay. Cucumba. Cucumba. Mm -mm -mm -mm. If you need to know why this is great, Listen to the cucumber song, and he'll tell you all you need to know about health and wellness. I'm gonna squeeze it. I'm gonna let these ones go in just to give it a little. Actually, no, I changed my mind. <laughs> I don't like the way they look. They just look like shriveled up, like used raisins at the bottom. I changed my mind. I am notorious, notorious for like changing my mind or being indecisive. I'm working on it. Okay, mint, I did rinse this, and I rip it because I feel like it infuses better that way, but also I'm sure it doesn't really matter at all. So, tossing some mint. It's just so nice, like fresh herbs. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. How much? A lot, let's just go for it. I bought two packs of mint. I'm gonna use one, one full pack of mint. Just makes me feel like I also like having mojitos or something, like I don't know, kinda nice. And last but not least, cucumbers. With everything that I do, I kinda just wing it, you know, just wing it and see what happens. Cause you never know. You never know what's gonna happen. Life is like a box of chocolates. You just gotta experiment with that shit and see how it goes. Then, we are going to add hot water. Good. Not a lot, I guess, because that's all that's in there. And also, I just wanna shake it. So I'm gonna do that to like. <laughs> I think because it's hot, it's like the steam is pushing it off. Okay, 
You know what I'm gonna do instead? I'm gonna muddle it. So I'm gonna stab the mint and mix it all together. Give that a nice chance to, to come together and create a nice melody of mint and cucumber. Like a hot, refreshing, just beverage for a summer day, you know? Okay, that's good. My finger hurts. It hurts. Let's check on this bad boy. Like, this is good. I usually let it cool before I put it in the fridge because that's when, like, the glass and this and it's hot and it's cold and it, it blows up and it's not good. I also want to kind of squish, like, the cranberries have their own juice in it. So if you smush them, get that flavor. I'm gonna let these soak for a little bit and come back. I'm gonna also add more just regular water to this. You know what? Let's just add more mint. F it. I'm gonna make this like strong and then maybe I'll mix it with like I'll do half and half later. You do you boo. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna clean up this. I'm gonna let this cool down and I will BRB. Mm hmm. Time for a taste test. So, oh, that's not gonna work. Okay. Time for a taste test, okay? We're back. Time for a taste test. Time for a taste test. Okay, so when I do this, I generally, personally, I try to get just the liquid. And I only want like a sample, okay? Yeah, I also made it like, you know, nice looking. Ooh, all right, let's see how these taste. Nice aroma, hints of dish detergent. <laughs> it smells like actual dish detergent. Ooh, it's like sour. Sour. Mm, I think I put a lot of lemon in there and the cranberries give it such a zing That's got a lot of taste, but you can taste test it and see I probably would dilute it a little bit with water mm. Yeah. Mm, I like this one It's way more like mild like I feel like I'm drinking actual water with just like a hint of things. I like this one better than this one, but I probably just put too much in it and made it like too strong. So yeah, you can try it at home, see what, see if you like it. I mean, I'm not telling you what to do. You're your own person, you can do what you like. Um, anyways, that's the end of this video. I hope that you enjoyed it and maybe found some tips or tricks that were useful and um, yeah. A quote that I saw was, or it wasn't even a quote, it was like a meme, um, but it was just saying your first video is going to suck, your first podcast is going to suck, your first book is going to suck, anything that you do right off the bat, you're going to suck at it and you must do it in order to get better. Like you're not going to get to your 50th video, for example, without doing your first one. So hopefully you did enjoy this video, really I'm trying to dedicate myself to actually finishing it and seeing things through. So hopefully you found it entertaining. I would love some feedback and advice on how to make my video better and more enjoyable for you. Um, and I think that's it. So have a great day. Love ya. Peace out. Goodbye. Catch you in the next one. Until next time. Hasta la vista. Peace. Thank fuck that Mercury Retrograde is over. Cause that stuff like hit hard. So if you hit, felt those hit hard vibes like I did, things are kind of easing down a little bit.